How's it going? This is Phil Saab, and this is my fourth and final video out of the bridge level for the Fonfis Tactics 1.3 Deep Dungeon. Uh, this team setup is very blitz based. So, what I have is three time mages, all rocking auto haste and 16 speed, and short charge. So, what they'll be doing is all charging a quick onto my calculator up front with draw out. In addition to her, uh, there is also Ramza. He is a monk with attack up, earth, clothes, and bracer. So uh, his earth slashes at neutral combat can do 720 damage, which is a number I like. And uh, there is my superstar of the fight. She has 31 MA and magic attack up. So I will be expecting her to just cleave through everything she encounters. Because, uh,. How close all these TMATs are, I can't really do that much charge time damage, so it has to be instant and quick. And with these time mages, uh, after they all, and actually they're all good, good compat with her too, so it leads to some uh, very likely quicks, like Grace is the lowest with 85. But uh, they all get a double turn, because they're that fast and the dragons are that slow. So my little draw out calc is up first. Gets a three hit off right here and damages them all pretty significantly. 714 and 374, it looks like. Then the first quick resolves. Uh, my primary target right here is to take out these dragoners. Uh, primarily because, one, they have Holy Bracelet and it'll rape my face off. I think it does like 720 damage if I let it do its thing. But uh, also, they have Monster Skill and the two team mats in the back, what they're going to do is get near the dragoners and then embarrier the other dragons and it just really gets bad because those are all nasty stats but thankfully quicks resolve and uh... they all get two shot so that little cluster's dead so pull back a little bit if i get a quick right here my plan is to do a little kiku and then run the heck away that did not happen however so she's just kind of a sitting duck right now and uh... just kind of fought on like a like, stranded marine she is but, so, everyone gets their double turn. Uh, that one time age, she has Ying Ying magic. So what she's going to do is pick off one of the guys who has less than 300 health. That time age has white magic. She'll charge it onto Ramza. Because uh, if she charges a haste onto Ramza, for example, Ramza will not die. The AI won't even bother killing him. It's going to go after something else. And I want to have Ramza stay alive. So it's very much a preemptive res. Ramza was gonna spin fist right here and kill them both but uh, apparently I forgot to train that skill so I just killed the tougher one and I hope this other guy, other guy in the back is not gonna come back and haunt me too much so once all these moves are taken care of uh, comes all the dragons turn uh, they're a humongous fan of dark whisper and thankfully they are not all too lucky with it tonight Yeah, that's uh, six shots and not a single one on the calculator. Awesome. Ah, her first shot. She also has MP switch, though, so uh, she's able to absorb one or two hits before her MP runs out, which is hopefully will be the difference between life and death. We'll see how lucky she gets. But yeah, like in an earlier build, I tried what I did before on the earlier dragons when they were, you know, a little farther away, so I had, like, full protection knights casting meteor onto a little plague in the corner. They had, like, uh, white white robe, Excalibur, and Inkai armlet, so anything anyone could have done to them, they either absorbed or took it half damage. But they still ended up dying, because if you don't do anything, that's like ten Dark Whispers in your face. It, half, half darkness will not save you from that. Uh, anyways... If you just saw what happened, my time age up top died and Ramza lived because Ramza was of course getting a raise charged onto him. And so, time age, your sacrifice is noted. Raise resolves and of course Ramza doesn't need it. I was charging a haste too, just because in case Ramza did die, he'd be hasted right off the bat. But uh, what that did is, with Reyes waiting in place, it didn't resolve in time. So I'm going to nix that idea 
res up the downtime mage and go to town with that. Meanwhile, my uh, calc has 77 health and zero magic, so next set she's dead. And looking around at what she can do and all their little AT and what their CT is currently at, looks like it's in my best interest to attack dead ahead and then wait in place in case I got a double turn. Meanwhile, this girl can't decide on what to do right here. Ram's not up for a while, got two dragons up. Probably the two fast ones that just got Kiku. So, uh, let's do a little quick onto Ramza. And of course, those two are best combatant, so, uh, 100% right there. I can finish off that guy because he has less than 300 health if I wanted to get to him, and I can't, so I'm going to charge a Dimmy near him, which is only going to do 250. He has like, I think, 290 something, so he's just going to be walking around with 40 or so health. He'll be critting, so he'll probably attack once and just run in into the corner. But anyways, Ramsey gets his quick turn, and uh, he earth slashes those dragons, and they all die, because they all got weakened by Kiku. So, right now it's down to two dragons and one crit. And they're coming up soon, so I can't charge anything. So, see what Reyes can do with uh, her basic melee. She has a back equipped, so go... never mind. 14 damage. Yeah, the uh, dragon's still alive. Uh, Calc's up, seeing good position where she can do some draw out fun, and hopefully have Ramsa finish him off. Looking at the AT. Hmm. Probably best to ugh, get onto a panel that is not gonna be a definite kill shot from Dark Whisper. Like that panel up top, yeah, you don't want to be there because it has zero ver vertical talents around it. And uh, if that happens, you're dead meat. But anyways, the AI has a hard on for Reyes for some odd reason. I guess because she is item. But uh, if I was a dragon right now, I'd want to kill the calculator or Ramza. But that's me. But they're just going to dance around Reyes. Yeah, Reyes dodged all of them. And can she do it again? <laughs> Doesn't. Not off to a good start. Up three. Then she's eight and two. Yep, there she goes. Down. And one more for good measure. And then he runs off to the corner. Great. And now, with those two taken care of, uh, they can't kill both the Calc and Rams in one shot. So if either of them were to go down, the other one would pick up the slack. But again, this guy went after the Time Mage, who was charging a quick onto Ramza. So, uh, I now have two people capable of killing him. Uh, meanwhile, see for a teleport right here, see if I can get 90% to work, and it thankfully does. So, uh, do live stream like I was supposed to a long time ago. Knock this guy out. Wish I actually were to absorb this m health, but, uh, no dice there. And Rams is up, find a nice position that I can earth slash them both in. And knock him out. Uh, Blitz is very effective here. Hope you liked it.